Hey friends, uh, it's Mr. J uh, in the gym here. Actually just doing some cruising around on my scooter here. Um, in a minute you're gonna see the items that I use, or I'm going to use for our all sports golf game. So if I just turn my computer here, uh, you're gonna see my items that I have on the ground here. So using a variety of items that I found in the closet here at Parkside. Uh, but for you, if you don't have sports equipment, you know, you can use any household item that you can think of that would be safe to throw inside or outside of your house. But like I said, be creative. It could be a shoe. Uh, it could be a rolled up dish towel. Uh, it could be a roll of toilet paper. Um, obviously, you know, you, you wouldn't want that to come unraveled because it'd be a big mess. Uh, but like I said, be creative and think about what objects you could use to throw for our all sports golf game. Just because it's called all sports golf game does not mean you only have to use sports equipment. So a few of the items that I have on the ground here, as you can see behind me, I have a soccer ball. I have a football, uh, I have a tennis racket and tennis ball, I have a badminton racket and a birdie, I have a hockey stick and a puck, baseball bat and a wiffle ball, frisbee, uh, and also a yarn ball as well. So when I take each shot today for my all sports golf game, I have to use a different item. And I'm going to have to use the item uh, exactly how it's intended to be. So for example, let's say if I were to use the soccer ball first, for my first stroke, I would have to kick the soccer ball towards my target, and then wherever the soccer ball lands, I would then have to use a different item because I could not use that soccer ball again until the next hole. Same goes with the baseball bat. If I choose to use the baseball bat, I would have to hit the wiffle ball with the bat, and that would count as a stroke for me. Remember, we're aiming for the lowest score possible. Golf is unique in that the lowest score wins. So you want to think about what objects you want to use, what obstacles are in your way, uh, because that is going to ultimately determine your score. If you have obstacles that are on the ground, then you may not want to use, let's say, the soccer ball, because the soccer ball is going to bounce and roll, and it could easily hit one of those obstacles. You may opt to choose an object that you throw in the air so it could clear those obstacles, and the obstacles will not get in your way. Like I, say, sorry, like I said, friends, be creative. You can see the objects that I'm using. Obviously, I have uh, the closet here at my disposal, but for you, you can use whatever items you have at home. Just because it's called all sports golf game does not mean you only have to use sports equipment. Okay, in the next part of the video, friends, you're gonna see me tee off for hole number one. All right, so take care.